Hi, my name is Catherine Went with Syscon and thanks for taking a moment of your time. Today I wanted to answer a question that I put to our techs and I thought I'd share the answer with you. When it comes to firewalls, what is the difference between the hardware and software? And they gave me a great answer, so I'd like to share it with you. So first of all, what is a firewall? Well, a firewall is a barrier uh, and in construction, most of our clients are in the construction industry, uh, they are very familiar with the analogy because we've got a firewall which is usually made of block and it's protecting, it's a barrier between two units. In the IT world, uh, the firewall is a barrier between the network where all your computers are and the whole world, the outside world, the internet. In fact, when we do a diagram of a network, we draw the firewall as a small block, sometimes even with a little flame above it, to show that that is the barrier, that's the protection. So what's the difference between the hardware firewall and software? So the hardware is usually a physical device on the network and it runs independently from the computers. So whether they're on or off, the firewall is on, up, and running. It's filtering information and traffic. It protects the entire network, so any of the devices that are on the network, which could be the computers, of course, but cameras and other things that might be in the network. It offers deeper and more advanced protection features and configuration options because it's its own unit. And it is a great way to allow or restrict traffic. You might have special rules for a camera system, or you might have a bank that actually is hosting its servers in the Netherlands and you need to be able to get there. So those are the things that a physical firewall can do for you. All right, so on the other side is the software. The software is only going to be on one independent computer. It's installed on that computer. It is going to uh, monitor the traffic in and out for that computer only. And of course, it's only up and running when the computer is up and running. Very basic level of protection. Now, if you have computers in an office, we would recommend that physical hardware firewall device uh, for all those reasons I just mentioned. And if you have a very busy office, those advanced features are going to be very helpful, especially if you have cameras and things like that and a lot of people on the network. So there you have it, software versus hardware for a firewall. If you have any questions or you want to go over any of this or you want to make any changes in what you have, please give us a call. We'd be happy to talk that through with you. Thanks for your time and hope you have a great rest of your week.